Hello, beautiful people. Rebecca Thompson here, and oh my gosh, it has been a, the most amazing day. I am here in our gorgeous look room here on beautiful Bribie Island in our garden room, and I've just completed the first day of our three day Be A Beacon immersion. If you don't know um, what I do, I run programs for women called Be A Beacon. It's all around helping women to do what they love and make the big impact that they, is their sacred mission that they wanna be here to make and help them do that without compromising their health and well-being, without compromising their feminine and get out of all those handbrake sort of fears and doubts. I'm struggling to hold this, it's been a big day. And day one is all about creating safety within because we create safety or we look to create safety around us. Just see what we're doing in the world right now with all the global uncertainty. When we have fear, when we have uncertainty, when we have worry, what do you do and where do you look? Now, commonly we try to reason with the mind. We try to go outside of ourselves and make our environment more safe. And we might, I don't know, what else do you do? Let me know, let me know on here. What do you do to try and create a sense of safety when you are worried, when you are uncertain, when you are fearful? Now, obviously there's some things that we need to do if we know that we're about to be run over by a truck, you don't go and jump out into the road. But what we are saying is that life is uncertain. Life is constantly changing. And if you want to create real safety so that you can move forward in a powerful and courageous way and not lose momentum, Katrina, you go shopping to create safety, right? You're not the only one, right? Have a glass of wine to feel calmer, more safe, right? I totally get it. But if we don't come and understand what we are doing in trying to constantly change our environment to create safety and also then for create happiness and ease, then we are gonna continue down this road of suffering and struggle. So today we have been highlighting what is it in the mind? What does the mind hook on, onto? And there are five root causes of suffering that the mind does. We've been looking at those. And then we've been looking at how does our body respond to stress? How is our body holding stress patterns? And how can we work with our body in order to feel safe so that the mind has a chance to change its mindset because you can tell yourself you're safe or you're not attached to something or you don't um, you know, have a fear of letting something go. But if you can't sort of really fully embody that, then you're just telling yourself in the mind and it's not really happening. You're not really shifted or changed anything because we have energetic patterns, we have emotional patterns and we have physical patterns that are still telling us that we're not safe, that there's something to be worried about. And so we have to look at all those different aspects. We have to look at the physical, we have to look at the emotional, we have to look at the energetic and the mental and the environment all together. And that's what we've been doing today. And it has just been so cool to see everyone come in because it was day one. So some of them are brand new to this work and some have been coming all year. And to see that little bit of uncertainty and fear and anxiety that always happens in a new group, in a new situation. And to be checking in with them all day around this work and you know the way that they are bonding together by the end of the day, the way they're so excited, the way that people are coming up and going, oh my God, I feel so amazing already. This is so, so good. This is just what I need. And we're all trying to you know, help everyone work out how to integrate this into their day because you, know, you can't just go away and have a deep dive experience and not know how to integrate that into your world. So this work is all about how do we integrate that sense of safety? How do we integrate these practices into your every day, into your every moment so that you can move through the world feeling safe, feeling certain, feeling confident in who you are and then you can be unwavering no matter what happens around you because life is going to happen right no matter what but if you can be that unwavering presence no matter what that's what we want and you get to shine your light and make the big impact that you are born here to make girlfriend. So 
If you think, wow, that sounds really cool and I would love to know more about that, just drop a little comment in here and just say, yes, please tell me more or something along those lines because um, we have a three-day immersion and we have a whole year program. We also have half-day intros to this work. So let me know if you would love some more information about any of that and we can um, contact you. And thank you for the love coming through the screen, beautiful women and beautiful Katerina and uh, whoever else is watching can't quite see because I've got my glasses on. All right, beautiful people, have an amazing evening. You are safety, you are love, and um, yeah, reach out if you want to know any more. Take care, everyone.